Tell me what's going on with you. Well, if you really want to know, do you really want to know? I really do. A few weeks ago, I was here, I was talking to Hoda, and I told her I had a secret. And I couldn't tell anybody. And we were talking about how hard it is to keep a secret. Yes. But now I can tell everybody. What? Breaking news. My son, Gabe, that Ben did not accept for a long time. Your middle child. My middle who's child. Who's your angel, right? They're, they're all my angels. Okay. But, but uh, tell the truth. <laughs> you are a troublemaker. <laughs> He's... He's a sweetheart. He's an angel. He got engaged. Yeah. Like two weeks ago, yeah. Oh and, my gosh. and yes, there he is. That's his wonderful bride to be, Allie, and their dog, Arthur. There they oh, are. So and, cute. and they're in Seattle. Um, he works for Como in Seattle. He's a reporter. And she works for a little startup called Amazon. And, um, <laughs> and he wrote a book. He wrote a book to Allie. Um, it was so beautiful. And, and it was story. attached to, yeah, it was attached to the harness of the dog who walked it out from this little lake they were hiding, uh, the dog and a couple of friends. And then she read, and I, I wasn't there for that, and crying, and then got down on one knee, proposed to her, and gave her my mother's ring. And my mom had passed away a long time ago, but she would have loved Allie. But being the good bro the brother that he is, he called Ben and Lily, his brother and sister before, and said, would you mind if I gave them Nana's ring? Gave her Nana's ring, and, and they said yes. It was so beautiful. And I love... Her parents. Oh, good. Tracy and Robin, her that sister Lauren. Which, no, it, it isn't. And I probably wouldn't tell you if I hated them, but I don't hate them. They're fantastic, fantastic people. So, when and we were all married? there. We don't know yet. Okay. And they actually resent, and I get it now. Asking. Stop, yeah, stop asking yeah. that already. But they would never have gotten married, I believe, had it not been for today. Because they met at the 2012 London Olympics. That's they were what runners. I was just they were thinking. there. They are. And they were just friends there, and then they both ended up in Spokane. I, that's not the queen, <laughs> although they said it is. Looks a little like me. I but, was thinking. Um, and then they ended up in Spokane together as report. Oh, you remembered them? Yes. Then? Oh my remember gosh. Gabe, remember yes. that's when we came up with that show we wanted to do called The Baby Bachelorette. Oh, you're right. Oh, remember? That's right. We thought we should merge what like to that toddlers show? and tiaras and the you Bachelorette. Went on. You went on. Yeah. <laughs> well, it didn't work out. I know, I know. Um, but I, I went on to have babies, and now yeah. I'm setting them up. Well, that is such good yeah, news. Yeah, so then they, they ended up in Spokane as reporters, and somewhere along the line fell in love, and now they're in Seattle, and the rest is history. But I'm so happy for them. Yeah, oh there they are gosh. in Spokane. You know, it's so funny that you brought up those questions that people hate because when um, Mrs. Obama wrote her book, she said one of the questions that bothers her that we ask little kids is what you want to be when you grow up. Oh, yeah, yeah. And, and for some reason, it flusters Mila. When I ask her that, she's like, wait, I'm five. Like, why do I need to decide what I'm going to be when I grow up? Well, good for her. She's very independent thinking. Though. There are a whole list of questions, though, that really bother people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That and when you're going to have a baby. Yes. Although I am Googling now nicknames for grandma. I have to say, I am. Grammy, Nana, Mimi, Grams. We wanted to call, um, my, my, my dad is jefe, oh. which means boss in Spanish. <laughs> He's got a complex. That's um, interesting. That, that's what they refer to their grandfather as jefe? Well, who do you think designed the name? <laughs> You're the one Googling. <laughs> jefe. Yeah, okay. He wanted somebody to still call him the boss. And, and what is your mom? And then my mom is Grammy, like her mom. But we wanted her to be Mimi Meowskers or something like that. And she was like, no. And then we were like, what about Lala? She was like, and then when I go crazy, you'll be like, Lala over there. <laughs> well, my, my um, husband's mother is Mimi. And my mom was Nana, so. So you're going to be Mimi Nana? I don't know. My, my nickname when I was growing up was Ditsy. But that's too weird, right? Ditsy? Wait, why'd they call you that? Be well, the truth is my brother, Jeff, who was a little bit older than me, like 14 months older, couldn't pronounce Meredith. So we married Meredith. He so, had a little list. So really, he was the ditzy one. Well, yes, <laughs> apparently. But, uh, and then my mother thought it would be cute to say ditzy. And then when I was in high school, boys would call and she'd say, ditzy, John's on the phone. And they would think, she said, with a T. So yeah, well, that's like, what I yeah. think it was. So everyone's like, wow. Even the yeah. mother's like, Connor, like, <laughs> so anyway. But it's ditzy. But I'm not going to be ditzy because I think that's a little weird. <laughs>